Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. Hello if you're new here, my name is Bells and today I spent a lot of money on some track suits and I'm ready to show you all of them. I'm telling him. I ain't even going to the clubs dressed up no more. I just let the promoter know. Man's coming in a tracky. We take this for. I think I spent, I'm not even that sure to be honest. Around 600, 6 to 700. I think that's what I spent in total. I don't know, that's the price will be on the screen. Okay, so with this tracksuit haul, honestly, it was quite difficult to find tracksuits that I like, that worked with my style, that I'd actually wear out. Um, tried to find them for different occasions. There were some of like, um, I don't like too much, too much graphic stuff on my uh, track tracksuit and then sometimes I don't like the way the logos look I don't really like the neon colors on tracksuits I don't like them to be too bright I'm just very very picky and obviously some came I love some came I didn't love you'll see all of it let's get into what I got so we'll start off let's start off with what I'm wearing which is also the cheapest tracksuit I got this is what I say it's like a tracksuit it's kind of like a tracksuit okay so this is from misguided it's just like a normal hoodie so this is from misguided I did I believe I got everything for 54 pounds I'm not 100% sure obviously everything links will be down below so you guys can go check it out so it was like 54 pounds very comfy very cozy this is something I'd wear if like I was in uni and I had like a night shift to do at, at uni had lectures but still wanted to be comfy and cozy had some errands to do but not that many people see me so it's kind of like oh, I'm in and out or even just lounging around the house it's really really comfortable very very soft Feels really nice, very stretchy. I got a size small, but honestly, I think um, this would also fit someone who's like from maybe a size eight to a size 12. If you're like a size six, I'd say try to get extra small. I hope it's still on the website. I'm actually filming this like almost a month later from when I purchased everything, which is really bad. I haven't got around to it, I'm really sorry. I know they've also got a color in gray, so if you don't want the cream one, get the gray one. But yeah, I really, really love it. You can't go wrong, 54 pounds for the top and the bottom. Um, You have to buy the sets individually, no, you have to buy the items individually, but that's what roughly they came up to. So the next item is is, uh, it's like a three piece set from Mesh Key. I've had this um, already for ages. I've, I've got actually got this gifted from Mesh Key about a year, mm, not a year ago, probably around October. And I wore this to the airport. I was on my way to Greece. If you watch my Greece vlog, you'll see me wearing this. It's basically a top with cycle shorts and a hoodie, very, very comfortable. 100% um, like perfect for if you're going somewhere hot but you still want to be cozy. Um, so you get a top cycling shorts, but they're not your average cycling shorts. They kind of hold you at the waist. I got a size too big in like everything. I got size too big. I got medium and everything, but I think you should really size down because um, they fit quite uh, loose because they're quite to be. They're meant to be comfortable and not meant to be uncomfortable. And I got medium and it. Um, it's just a bit big, especially around the waist and the hoodie is quite big, but it's fine. I can like I don't mind an oversized hoodie, but the cycling shorts do fit quite. Um, loose so definitely size down they fit amazing i love the color i love the sage i love that i don't need to wear it with the hoodie if i'm like if, like i said if i'm summer hot as soon as i got to greece i kind of tied around my waist i think this is like a cute spring outfit for airports for errands it's not too short to where you feel a bit uncomfortable and the hoodie does cover my bum so I, like i feel comfortable going out and about in it um it depends on you guys if you don't mind showing a bit of leg then this a bit of you and if you're going somewhere hot like this will always be one of my outfit uh, airport fits like I don't need to take pictures in it all the time but I will definitely be wearing this more price of it it'll be linked down below I'm, I'm, I'm not good with prices but yeah this was gifted so I didn't spend money on this but I did spend money on other things <laughs> okay oh okay so the next item basically I was on Netaporter just looking online and I wanted to see what like um, they had at Adidas <clears throat> and I don't know if they, these were matching because when they came in I'm going to show you guys a cutaway when they came in um, when they got them the materials are both different however I do love them together this is more polyester and the top is more fleece but I like the contrasting look together and I don't think they're meant to be together I think it's meant to this is meant to be with like a zip up jacket however the way the model had it on on 
in the image, I was like, I'm just gonna get what she got. And I really like this together. The top, do I have it with me? It's, it's in the corner over there, but I'm basically returning it because these top, the jumpers run a bit big. So they're a bit big on the top. I got a size 10 and I think I should have got a size eight and I probably couldn't even get away with a size six. Um, I still like it looking a bit more baggy at the top and this is quite tight on the legs. I'm gonna return the jumper and then get a size eight and then I can't wait to wear it and style it out. Like I can't wait. I've already posted a picture, I know I have. But I can't wait to have a nicer fitted size and then wear that out with like trainers, you can wear it with heels, whichever. But yeah, I'm really, really happy with this purchase. Um, the top and the bottom came to £98 together. Okay, next. Ooh. <laughs> this is my most expensive purchase. But I can explain. So I purchased from a brand called K Label. Um, you probably would have seen them on Instagram. Kylie Jenner wears them. Uh, yeah, they're really popular on Instagram. And I had been seeing this uh, blue tracksuit go around. It was like quite popular. And I had my eye on it for like a minute. And at first, I was just like, because it's two hundred for the top and the bottoms. It's two hundred and sixty-one pounds. And I was like, do I want to get it? But I was like, you know what? I know a lot of brands, they copy um, this brand. It's like a female designer. She's also from the UK. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna support her because her stuff is very original, very authentic, very like copied, especially on a lot of sites like Fashion Over, Pretty Little Thing, etc. And I was like, you know what? No, I'm going to spend my money on the actual designer and she's doing an amazing job. And, oh. Okay, so I think I got the top and the bottom, I got the bottoms in extra small and the top in small because I think they were close to running out of stock and they also have a brown one and a charcoal, charcoal colour one that I'm, oh, I'm gonna get the charcoal one, I'm gonna get it because when I tell you how it fits, in the camera, um, in the cutaway, I had just had a bowl of pasta so please forgive me, I had pasta and bread. <laughs> I don't know why I had that before filming a try on haul. But anyway, I had some pasta and bread, so I'm looking a little pudgy in the waist. But when I tell you, this is like a corset on the waist. But then your boobs sit perfectly on um, the boob bit. And I don't need to wear a bra with it because it's just nice and supported. I did get a size down, so I got a small fits amazing comfortably. The bottoms are extra small, but the bottoms are quite baggy, so it's still comfortable. Like I was chilling around the house wearing it to see how I feel, you know? But I'm genuinely happy with what I got and I'm going to buy another one of her colors. I'm gonna get this tracksuit in a charcoal because the blue um, is a bit bright and not, I can't always wear this, but I can wear the charcoal one. I'm so happy with this purchase. I know someone's gonna be like, 261 pounds? Yes, 261 pounds because she deserves it. She came up with the idea. A lot of people are copying her and I want to support. So then, okay, um, this one's a bit disappointing because I don't, I'm going to be returning this one. I'm just, I got like a grey um, tracksuit, grey tracksuit. However, the fit of this, I'm going to insert what the model hat was wearing. The fit of this really sold me and I'd seen other people on Instagram wearing it and it fit them and I was just like, yeah, I'm going to get that. It's like a grey um, tracksuit, but a bit different, a bit more... Uh, I wouldn't would it say cutting edge. I don't know. This one is a little more sophisticated. That's it. So a th more sophisticated hoodie. You guys know I'm all about rich auntie vibes and stuff. And I got this in a size small. And when I say guys, this tracksuit eats me up alive. Like I need an extra extra small for me to like this. It's just huge. It's ill fitted on me. I think maybe if I was taller, it would fit better. If you're tall, I think this would look amazing on you. But I'm not that tall and my legs aren't that long so it just doesn't really I don't do the outfit justice I don't think and it was a hundred pounds and I was like for a hundred pounds I would want this to fit me a lot better I would want to feel cute in it and I don't feel cute in it it just eats me up um I like the material it does feel a little itchy you know that type of wool that does feel itchy but like it's fine it would have been a perfect airport errands outfit chill with friends, go out to eat in it, because it's more like, like I said, it's more of a sophisticated fit. But um, yeah, I think the top was 50 and the bottoms were 50. And I just don't feel like I really got my money's worth. So this will be going back, back into the Zara box it goes, because it's not for me, I'm sorry. Why am I apologizing to you guys? I didn't pay for it, but 
it's, it's not a bit of me. So the next item I got is actually from AliExpress. I know AliExpress are closing down now because of the coronavirus, which is very annoying because I, I got this um, one piece. I know it's not a tracksuit, but I just had to put it in because when I went out to, I went out to my friend's house party because I could wear it to a house party. It was like a very house party-ish vibe. Um, a lot of people were asking me where it's from, so I was just like, yeah, I'm definitely, I definitely made the right choice. So I was like, let me insert it. And I know a lot of Instagram boutiques had this, but um, yeah, I saw it on AliExpress, and not that I don't want to support the businesses, but you know when you're like, I know where you got it from, I know exactly where to get it for cheaper for less. So I was just like, mm, like I want to support, but like, what is the point of support? If I could just, I, I can literally click on this thing and get it. It's a white um, jumpsuit onesie type of thing, and um, it's really cute. It's it, fit, it fits good. It fits my body good. It hugs my body. It's nice and stretchy. A little bit see through, so just make sure you wear um, black underwear underneath so it doesn't show, and make sure it's quite seamless as well so it doesn't show. But it's amazing. You can dress it up and look cute. You can dress it down, be casual. Only thing I don't like though is it's, that's, this is what you get with like AliExpress clothing and stuff. Is like the lucky label. It just says lucky label and it's just. I think I paid like £14 for this. Hopefully um, African Mall uh, still still sells because I'll leave the African Mall link down below because it's around the same price. Woohoo! Then I've got two more track suits. These are from Ocho, Ocho London. So this is like a hoodie and bottoms. This is very comfy, cosy. I wore this in my sugar wax video when I was going to go get my sugar wax. Comfy clothing. Do what you need to do. I like the bit at the back. I don't even know what that is. Is that anything? Does that say anything? I'm blind. I don't know. Artwork. <laughs> so that at the back and then I've also got one in black that wore with like a, I wore recently as well. I'm going to show you guys how I wore. I wore with like a um, bomber from Zara. I'll link that down below and some trainers. And I, I just felt, you know, for the all blacked out look because I know I couldn't do like a tracksuit haul without an all blacked out look. Like I, I could not. These were both gifted to me, so I'll leave the link down below. You guys can go check them out. Um, yeah, I like the material. I also like the pockets. The pockets are quite um, big, but then it gives you the illusion of like hips, if you guys want to like have that. That is it for my tracksuit haul. I hope you guys really like it. I know it was a long time coming. I had to get around to filming it and showing you guys. And yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Let me know what your favorite fit is. Let me know what you think of the tracksuits. We're doing chill, casual, cute vibes so yeah i'll catch you guys later bye